All right, so we are at not our first stop, but our first daytime stop on our journey to Disney. Uh, we are at the rest stop of the bypass in Macon, Georgia. Um, it was pretty dark out. We didn't bother stopping at the Georgia Welcome Center, which is something that we normally do in the mornings uh, on our drive down. But this morning we, uh, we opted to not stop and it was also about three in the morning when we drove by the Tennessee Welcome Center. We did get out, I took a couple pictures, but I didn't bother recording anything there. So this is the first process of our recording while we're on the drive. Um, so right now what you're seeing is the Macon uh, Bypass rest area. Um, on I-75, this is this is going to take us around Macon and uh, down past um, down past the uh, busiest portion of the area uh, through I-75. So this takes us around the around the back way. It saves about 40 minutes on the drive, but this is this is what the Georgia rest areas generally look like. Very peaceful. There is quite a bit of road noise right now, especially being that it is January, um, so there really isn't any um, leaves covering the trees, which also muffles the sound. But when we come down in May, uh, it's a lot quieter along here. But this is, uh, this is generally what the rest areas look like. If anyone has any questions about the drive or about any of the rest stops, um, stuff that they're doing at the rest stops, feel free to drop a comment below and uh, ask away. We'll be happy to answer anything we can. There's uh, dog walking areas as well. We'll go by and show you that also. They have some fun little artwork. They have great little like picnic areas under uh, undercover and open as well so this was a, another spot with a picnic table but this one seems to be not here right now there's a couple of empty spots uh, one that the kids and I would have normally stopped at um, and ate lunch at there was another table beside that one, but it's it's not there right now, so <clears throat> Yeah, this is a just a, a quick look at one of the sections of uh, The rest stop at the my uh, the making bypass and we will show you like I said We'll show you the dog walk area and things like that. We'll go up and around that area So over here is the dog walk area, and clearly you're required to clean up after your pets, but unfortunately, like most areas, there are those that don't. Yeah, so this is the, the pet area in here. Then this is walking back up towards the main buildings at the rest stop. So there's washrooms on both sides. So there's the information center side um, with staff inside to assist if you have any questions. And you have to be fully vaccinated to enter. Uh, masks are not mandatory if you're fully vaccinated here. Um, some people are still wearing them. I think I've seen more people wearing them than not. But yes, yeah, so on, as you enter the rest stop on the right is the restrooms, bathrooms, washrooms, whatever you want to call them. Um, being Canadian, we call them a washroom or a bathroom. And then on the left side is the info center with more bathrooms and you've also got all of your vending machines. This is also part of the Blue Star Memorial Highway. Right 
there. I'll add some still photos of that in as well. But this is rest area number 22, Monroe County. There used to be a cutout right here with some people that the kids and everyone could take pictures with. Uh, but it's obviously with the COVID situation, they've removed that. So then in there is your, is your uh, info center with all your pamphlets and flyers and info re about the area, things to do and discounts for hotels and stuff within uh, the state. Again, if you have any questions about any of the uh, rest stops or any uh, the amenities and stuff within the rest areas, please feel free to drop a question below and we will answer that for you. We got a bit of the sun in our faces walking up to where the vehicle is. But yeah, so this is all part of the, uh, the adventure along Interstate 75 on our way to Walt Disney World. But yes. So more of the more of the covered picnic areas for you to sit and have your lunch or breakfast or whatever the case may be. Uh, generally when we drive down this is more of our lunch area our lunch stop and the floor or the Georgia Welcome Center uh, at the top end is where we stop for breakfast but this time is uh, we got a little further through the drive than we expected not nearly as much traffic so we are way ahead of schedule so Yes, this is the uh, Macon Bypass rest area at uh, Interstate 75.